All right, good morning. As you can see, we're here on one of the greatest rivers in the whole world, the Mekong. Now, my mum and dad have never been to this part of the world, so we thought we're better to take them than Shang Khan here in Lui province. Just check this place out, it speaks for itself. So obviously we're on the Thai side. We've got Lao over there. We've just got mountains, jungle, the mighty Mekong, it's massive. It's bloody mesmerizing, it does not get old. And yeah, we've got the Shankam Riverfront. Absolutely beautiful place. So we're gonna spend the next few days here. I'm gonna film just little bits we get up to. And we're just gonna have a good time. Yeah, my dad's bloody amazed. He woke up, he's staying in a hotel like one of these. I'll show you, I'll show you the view from his balcony after. He says he can't bloody believe it. So yeah, let's go. We've got a dog over here. Sorry, Hab. Sorry, Hab. Hello, how are you? So bad, you might have. The cute dogs of Shang Khan. You coming for some brekkie? Yep. Yeah. Got a dog coming for brekkie wheels. What do you think of that? Good? Yeah? I can't believe how good that is. It's good, isn't it? Yeah. So we brought me dad for breakfast at a spot we came to last time. And we do this amazing noodle. I forgot what it is. It's like a sucky mix with a... What is it? Sucky... Like sucky interval mix. And it's absolutely fantastic. It's a bit dark in here, but... Yeah, we've got the rice noodles, the sucky sauce, there's pork in there, there's all kinds in. If you're here in Chiang Khan, you definitely have to check this place out because it's honestly so good. Just look at it. It's really unique. It's delicious. One of my favourite noodle soups we've had in Thailand. Bold statement, I've just thrown it all over my leg. It's really good though. Top on cab. What a little restaurant. Old wooden house, you can't beat it. Really cool spot. And there again, here we've got all the Canon Jean curries, whatnot, desserts. I'm going to show you our Thai coffee. It's some of the best in the world. So, do you have? Um, Ao Americano Yen Cap. Just that. So, this guy has got one of the greatest coffee shops I've ever seen set up. This is the cleanest, most organized thing I've ever seen. So, I'm going to show you. We're going to film him make. The whole process. I need cafe Madak Nai. Lao. Lao. Oh, Lao. Oh, okay, okay. Is it from like Paxi? Bolaven? Yes, Bolaven. Oh, okay. So on the Lao coffee, which would make sense because Lao is literally across the river on the other side of them buildings. How many grams? 18. 18 grams, okay. It's a bit gram. So he weighs it out on that little weighing scale and then it goes into the grinder. This is proper stuff. There we go. So that grinds away. But this is so cool how it's just done. Just on this little street, you've just got this like pop up set up. Couldn't you like have. Am. 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 Okay, you need have. Am. Am. Okay. Bomb to Ellis. 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 Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Right, so he's ground the coffee there. Huh? What do we do now? So he's got all kinds of crazy little tools. So the coffee he's thrown into there, and then he's gonna like mix it up with this little tool. Get it all evenly spread out. There we go. And then he's gonna push it flat, like press it. Look at that. Oh wow. Very skilled King Mag. Professional. And then he puts the lid on and gives it a bit of a puff. Like blow all the loose coffee off. And then it's hand pulled. Like hand pulled espresso. It's a normal machine. I really like these, I'm into these. So the water goes in the top. Look at that. And this is where the magic happens. Look at this now, he's gonna pull it, hand pull it. There we go. Can you see the coffee starts to drip through now? Proper stuff. 
proper stuff this. My dad loves it. My dad, today, he's had two already. It's like 10 a.m. He's already been here twice. And they do all kinds of drinks. They've got your Americano, they've got your orange juice coffee, which when you're in Thailand is a classic. And they've got like your, your milky coffees, your lattes and stuff, your teas. But this is what you want to be drinking, innit? Yes. Oh, that looks so good. What are the difference in these beans? Uh, this medium. Medium? Medium rose oh, okay. and medium dark rose. Oh, medium dark. So which, which one have I got? The, uh, medium. Medium? Okay, yes. medium. Good, good, good. It's got two different types of coffee beans. Very meticulous. Everything is weighed to perfection. Poured half it and shakes it, pours the rest in. This is good stuff, and then the ice is gonna go in. I'm king. Make it nice and cold because it's fucking roasting, it's really hot. I don't know if you can tell. It's so bright, look at the sky. Can we get a shout out for Shankar? Look how beautiful it is. Look at this for a beautiful street. It's gonna give it a little mix up. And then I think we're done. Wow, it looks so good. And the name of your cafe is, is One One Slow Bar. This is the name. Best coffee in Shankan. Best coffee in Louis. Uh, <laughs> How like have? 60 baht. Okay. 60 baht. Let's try and get the money out. Ooh. There we go. Look at this, everyone. 60 baht. You can't go wrong with that. We'll just get the change. Oh, couple of markup. Perfect. Should we taste it? <laughs> Hello, Mac. That's so good. That's really good. Oh, perfect. Couple cap. Okay, Chuck Lee cap. YouTuber. Yes, I will show you. I'll show you. You have. Channel. You have fun. Or right, I will write it. Thank you. Okay. Couple cap. Couple cap. Okay. Good luck, Chuck D. Uh, okay. I'm sad you're closed. You're closed tomorrow, Tuesday, Wednesday, closed. Yes. Oh, so this is the last one. Okay, goodbye. So that is a fantastic spot, and that is why the coffee in Thailand is just some of the best because it's Thai coffee, Thai coffee beans. It's made proper, there's no laziness, it's all done properly. You can't beat it. Oh, it's so good, so refreshing. Strong as well. Thailand, coffee games on top. So we're gonna head out on a little tuk-tuk mission soon. But I just thought I'd show you the front here in Shankan, the riverfront, because it's absolutely bloody beautiful. Look at this. Right by the Mekong, look at the views you've got. You just, camera never does it justice. You'll never get enough of these views. Like, it's so nice. You can see the town running all along the riverfront. All these hotels, guest houses, restaurants, coffee shops. It's so nice here, honestly. It's, it's just, you don't, you don't know what to say. So yeah, I just had to show you. It's a flipping beautiful place. It's well nice. Thing. Oh, you're not showing me up on. Oh. I thought you were showing you up. So we're all about to head out on this tuk-tuk adventure and mum and dad can't find the room key no matter what. They've got everyone searching for it. At least they've got Lee's checking the washing machines and stuff. It's in the, the electricity thing on the wall. You know, you have to put your car in for electricity to turn on. <sighs> what an idiot. Wow, we're here. I may as well just show you the beautiful temple, which is pretty much bang in the center of Shang Khan, literally across the road from my mum and dad's hotel. It's well nice in here. Really nice, peaceful. In the morning, you, you wake up and you can just see the chants in the monks. You can see it's beautiful. Look at this, it's really old. So yeah, so cool. Shankan is such a nice town, look at this. You can see in there the gold butter. Check it out. So nice. Right, off we go. Right, here we are. We're going to head out on a bit of a tuk-tuk mission. 
around Shangtan area and we're here with Zhang who took us last time we were here so we found him again and we've organised him to take us out for a few hours to a few different places so it should be good maybe we went out the first time in the tuk tuk excited we wanted to get in one of these for a while so we're off It's the first spot and the countryside is so nice here in Louis, Shantan. Like look around us. Just green jungle. Nice isn't it? Yeah, beautiful. So nice. And is telling us everything that we go past, everything we see, tells us what everything is. We don't speak fluent Thai, he doesn't speak English, but it doesn't matter. Right, so we're here, we just parked up. We're gonna head up a mountain somewhere here to a temple. Now to get there, we've had to ring our mate here, who's got a truck. So we're gonna jump in this truck and head up here somewhere. We've parked the tuk-tuk here. Can we get in the back? Can we get in the back? That might help. Oh, we can get in the back. Do you wanna get in the back or inside, mum and dad? You can, do, you can do either. We'll get in the back, we'll get in the back. We'll put mum and dad inside, we'll get in the back. The best way to travel always is always the um it's an absolute classic in it. Especially when you're in Thailand. Oh, wow. <laughs> pulled, oh. The, pulled the thing down to make it easier and I was like, no. Just jump we'll over. <laughs> right, off we go. We're on our way up. What a beautiful day we've got here as well. Look at this. Oh, this part of Thailand, this part of Isan is so beautiful. The Lui province, it's really, it's one of the best. Any, any what you what? like? Habat Pu Phayen. Habat Pu Okay. Oh no. That temple name is a bit of a mouthful. Sabat Di Khab. Oh, here we go, let's get out everyone. Hey, right, let's get out the truck. Oh. Oh, we've got to pay 40 baht to get up here. Okay. <laughs> so it's 40 baht per person, up and down. It looks so nice here, I can't wait to show you. We've just got to change off the lady. Perfect, okay. Couple of makeup. Right, there we go. We're here. Wait until you see this place, it's absolutely incredible. So this is called Wat Pra Putabat Pu Khoi Nyun. And I'm absolutely shocked. This is so gorgeous. I did not expect this. Look, we've got the jungle views into the valley down there. The mountains, it's amazing. Look at this. It's breathtaking. So we're going to have a walk round and just soak it in. So peaceful. Thai temples, they're amazing, aren't they? The one, they're all so like unique and always amazing. We've got the money buffalo. Look at this. Wow. Wow. I have no idea what to say when we come to these places. Right, we just nipped up to the viewpoint above the temple and oh my! That's incredible, that. <laughs> this is going to be one of the most beautiful parts of Thailand. It's incredible. You've never seen anything like it. Look at the view. Banana. 
What do you think, Mum? Come banana. here. Banana. Oh, book. Look at the view. Book. Banana. Yeah. It's beautiful. What do you think? Absolutely gorgeous. Really lovely. It's amazing. It is. I'm at Ben Mo. Wow. I'm at Don Chow Mo. So this village down here is a one road in, one road out job. You have to do a UE at the end if you want to come back out. And around it is just sticky rice fields, mango, what else these? Bananas. Bananas. It's like a, a valley, like a bowl. It's crazy. Crazy. So we're going to head back down and look at the rabbits. So this temple's special because they've got loads of rabbits in this enclosure here and they also have pigs. So we're going to get some food to feed them. What's this for? Katai. Katai. So we got we got some different food, eh? Should we get some of this as well? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get one of these as well. Sip bat. So it's ten baht for each thing you buy. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, just like an honesty box. Right, there we go. Let's see these rabbits. There we go, Leash. Oh, I'm giddy about this. <laughs> There's so many in here. Oh, we've got a raging plastic fire here. To be careful, huh? We're gonna head into the rabbit's enclosure. There's loads in oh there's so many of them. Look at this. They're everywhere. Oh you're cute, aren't you? So we'll just have a quick look what's in it. Can you see oh my there's so many. So we'll actually have a look over here. We'll go to where they all are, we'll see if we can sit with them. Oh this is well funny, hello. So I do have Oh wow, look at you all in here in the shade. Should we sit on the swing and feed you? Oh, don't, they're my sunglasses then, don't touch them. Put them to the side. Not some of the food, everyone. Anyone hungry? You, oh, you like the pellets more than this, don't you? Yeah? Oh, you're a bit scared, you're not scared. Well, this is funny, isn't it? Look how many rabbits are in here, look, they're all running over. <laughs> you're all right, aren't you? You're my mate. Oh look, you've all got the grass. Look at you. Just munching away. What a strange place. I'm happy though. Hey. Right, we're going to check out a pig. There's apparently a big pig in here. We've got a cock as well. So I do have... Where is it? I thought it was a storm. Oh my, it's <laughs> massive. <laughs> what is, it's getting up. That is a fat pig. One, one. One. So what do you have? <laughs> let's not give it you all, let's just give you a little bit, eh? Mr. Pig. Wow. <laughs> oh my. Look, we've got all the rabs here, the rabbits. Hello, everyone. Oh, Ooh, Ooh. Watch out. Go on then. You're not going to believe the size of this pig. This is ridiculous. Oh, he's nearly pulled me over as the lad. <laughs> Come on, you can have all that. There you go, you can have it, you greedy pig. That's ridiculous, that. That's the big. I've never seen a pig that big in my life. That's, that's ridiculous. Friendly. All right, are we all right? Oh, it's all right, isn't it? Look at this. Wow, it's just started to rain, as you can hear, through the trees, but look at over here. Still got this absolutely beautiful view, look at that. Wow, what a place. What a strange place to look, all these rabbits, the cock, the pig. I mean, that is that is an absolute beast, that, that is a mammoth. I don't even know what to do with this, what to say about it, look at it. That is ridiculous. Look at that. Oh gosh. Oh my goodness me. That's a beast. <laughs> All the rabbits are just bathing in the mud. They've dug little holes, you know, to like get some cool um, grounds. They're like lining these little pots they've made. Hello, I've not got any food, everyone. Oh, look at you. Oh. <laughs> They're just chilling out. Leashes here. The Rabbit Whisperer. Oh, look, leisha has got all the snacks here. Look, look at him. Legs hanging out, just, just chilling out, aren't yeah, you? I know, it's beautiful. So what do you have? Oh, oh, I'm scaring them. Here she is, the Rabbit Whisperer. Oh, they're well cute. Come on, everyone. 
<laughs> Busted. <laughs> you want to say hello to the camera? Say hello to the subs? What a strange place. I can hear it. Turn around. Oh God. Didn't expect that, did you? It's gonna squash that poor rabbit. <laughs> yeah, I did. Oh, should we save this rabbit? Mr. Rabbit, you need to move. This pig's gonna crush you. Come on, we need you to move. He's gonna sit on you. He's gonna sit on you. You need to get out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> you guys stink. Yep. All you. You stink. Oh, okay. Up on my cap. Chop the cap. Goodbye. Right. That was an amazing stop. We're gonna jump back in the truck, head down, then we're gonna get back in the truck so we've got like an hour drive to the next place. It's a secret. You'll find that when we get there. But it's somewhere we haven't been before as well. And Roy's jumping it back at truck wheels. I knew you were gonna do this, Dad. You can't not, can you? Oh. Here we go again, back in the tuk-tuk. About an hour's drive now in this bad boy. Let's go. Classic, classic seat. Right, here we are, next spot. That was like an hour drive with the wind blowing us all over the show. Our hair's all stuck up. But, we're going to investigate. Ooh. Big, big hair, yeah, wind, wind, wind. <laughs> the last time we met Chang, he had very long hair, he had luscious locks this time. He's had him smartened up, he's had him trimmed. Right, so the Skywalk costs 60 baht each. And you get a nice little ticket, look at this. So there we go. Copper marker. So I think we have to take another truck up somewhere. We'll find out. Go through here. Oh yeah, you have to put some silly socks on. Okay. So what do you have? Oh. oh, these are proper, aren't they? Look at these. Okay, okay, come on, cab. Okay. Right, let's see. Let's see what we have to do. All I know is we've got some silly socks. Honey. Ticket. Okay. We're taking a picture of us. Right, here we go. We're in number five. We've got to get another truck up to the top. This time it's um, a comfy one. It's a drop one. We've got the backrest and everything. It's like a cage. So we've got our socks in the truck. And now we're either going up, waiting for some more to jump in or what, I don't know. But we're on our way. We're, in the, we're all piling in. Everyone's piling in. Everyone's getting in. Up. On the way up in the jeeps. Right here we are. It's looking good. Go on, leash. Right, there's only a few of us here. It's not too busy, so we're just gonna head down here. I think we pop our socks on. Now let's check it out. We're here at the top. We've got a big Buddha. Check this out. And then the Skywalk, the Shankan Skywalk. So, Leisha's already got her shoes on. We need to slip these on her. So I'll, I'll pop myself on the edge here. Put our um, feet covers on. Leisha, can I pass you that? Oh, they're lovely though, that Alice. Burgundy, worst color on earth. That's a fact. It's no worst color. Are they come? Oh, wow. oh, like an elf, look at that. Cute. Okay. Have I done it wrong? Oh, it's, she put your shoe on. Oh, you put it over your shoe. Oh, right. <laughs> so you put it over your flip. Lovely flip flops. That seems wrong. Oh. oh, you're like a little elf. I'm not. I'm not sold on this. <laughs> this I'm in. A bit weird, isn't it? I'm in. Well, they look. Look at his handbag. <laughs> 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 Looks so gay. <laughs> right. <laughs> Here we go, look at this everyone, what? Alright, let's go for it. The Shenkan Skywalk. Umbrella. 
I'm guessing that's for the sun more than the rain in the middle of the day, obviously. We're in Thailand, everybody hates the sun. Oh, this is mad. This is going to be well nice. So this is see-through, but this isn't glass. So in a minute, it's glass floor. We'll check it out. Right. Here we go. So it's a see-through floor, which does actually feel weird to walk on. But it's not that high up, so... Have a look. It's not that scary. I'm actually scared of heights, but I don't mind this. It is a bit of a big drop though underneath. But holy moly, look at the view up here. This is mad. Wow. I don't know what to say up here, again the views are just mental. So here we have the Mekong River, the mighty Mekong, and it's the scale of this never gets old, it's ridiculous. Lao over there, Lao over there. We've got the little river that meets the Mekong. Again, that's, that's the border between Lao and Thailand. I'll show you in a minute. It's crazy. Can you feel it shaking? It just moves a little bit, it's nothing. It's not scary, you can see through it though, look. You can see the floor. You can see my sexy shoes. What do you think of the views though? What? The views are amazing, but I can't look down. It's not that bad. I'm scared of ice, it's not. It's not that great, <laughs> What do you reckon, Dad, with your shoes on? Are you going to take a pair of them on to England? <laughs> it really does move up here when people are walking around the winds are like rocks it's weird you can feel it bouncing so i'll just show you where we are here we're on the tar side here this little river is the border and then the border then goes into the mekong and along the mekong so that is lao this patch of land is also Lao, and on the other side of the river is Thailand. So this is all Lao. It's well nice. <laughs> what a place. Stunning. Just give you one last quick look before we leave because the sun has properly just gone down now and it's so nice here it's bloody well nice you can't believe it look at this skywalk shankan oh louis province it's up there it's up there electrocute you that's one thing i've got to tell you if you're walking around some static going on and you get electrocuted so here you can see a young chap crossing on his little boat from Lao to Thailand. Wonder what he's going over for. Anyone can just cross freely here like. You need to nip over to Lao, you need to pick up a cock on this side and bring it back to the other side. You can do it here. It's free crossing. There is police and immigration knocking around but... Oh you get that static shock. There are police and immigration checkpoints. There's actually like an official crossing in Shankar but... I love these type of borders, so, you know, like soft borders where anything can happen, like here. There's always dead good border markets in these type of places, you know, like where everyone just crosses over for the day and just like shops and sells and then goes back. Shankan Skywalk, um, very good place, very enjoyable, eh? Look, she's on big picks, look. Wee, wee. Right, back down we go. 
need to pop our slippers in here. There we go, slipper bin. And then we're off. Police checkpoint here. Sawadee kha. 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 Sawadee Alright then, here we are back in Shankan. Okay. okay. Oh, maybe like, maybe like, we go, we go down here. I don't like. Uh, here, okay. Tini, Tini. Double um, mark up. If you are ever in Shankan, Chang is the man you want. I'll put his number in the description. Ani, Ani Kun. Okay, this is his number, I'll put it in the description. And then here you can um, you can head out with him. Okay. Double mark up. Chok Lee up. Goodbye. Okay, goodbye. We're getting out of here because we have to speak to the boat people. Organise a little thing for tomorrow. We're back in Shankan town now. Just nipped to a little stir fry shop. Felicia's got a pad to see you. Ooh, it's so good. We never order this, but actually we should eat it more. Should order it more. It's really good. And then my dad's got pad pit gang. And then I've got... I don't know what he said, I think he just said pad pick. But yeah, let's try it. I've got moo crab, crispy pork and mince pork. It's actually good. It's sweet, but very spicy as well. <laughs> oh, look at that. Look at these pieces of um, crispy pork and then we've got the egg. Oh, that's a good egg. Look, that's a massive piece of moo crab. Whoa, look. Mm. Right, this will be the last stop of the day. We just have to walk down the Shankan walking street to get home. It's like a little night market. But we're going to get one of these. Okay, we'll get one. Okay, I'll then cab. So these are 40 baht. So you sit back for a cantaloupe where they scoop out the insides and they make the like little balls and then they also stuff in coconut milk and ice cream. And the cantaloupe coconut. Coconut. Yeah, it looks really good. Ice cream is coconut milk. Coconut milk ice cream, perfect. They're very cute, aren't they? <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> okay, cup and cup. Cup and cup. Look at that. Aloe mai. Aloe mai? Oh, okay. It's not bad that for 40 baht. Come on, let's try it. Delicious, yeah? Oh, okay. He wasn't lying. He said lying. Oh, oh. Let's try and... Um, Oh, yeah, when you get one of these out, it's like a Jenga. It's all going to fall over. Yeah. Let's try it. He's testing over his ties, speaking rapid speed. It's actually good, that. It's a coconut milk ice cream cream, but that's like... Melanie. It's going to fall. Like a Jenga. Tower fall over. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. <laughs> Dropping it. Oh, have I dropped too many pants? Really? <laughs> You just missed them. Oh no. <laughs> Too hard to eat. Coffee Too difficult. Man. Okay, couple mark up. There we go. Design floor. Design floor. Go on. Tell everyone that. There's a design floor at the beginning because you lose look two or three melon balls. <laughs> and lots of ice cream too. <laughs> Every time you scoop it out, yeah. you drop stuff down the same. He's dropped off his own floor. That ice cream is delicious though. It is really good actually, isn't it? Well good. If you don't throw it on the floor. If you can actually get it in your mouth. And then what do you do with the little ball at the end? You wear it as a hat, I think. I was waiting. Oh, you put it on a little dog's head as a hat, Chihuahua. Is he going to sell them at some design? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dad's going to tell the, um, the boss owners of the shop that there's a design floor. Not doing it right. They're not doing it right. Hello, Mac, he did. Hello, Mac. <laughs> 